And happening later today, the governor plans to approve $5 million in funding to increase security for nonprofits and places of worship. And the leaders say that this couldn't come at a better time, as we've seen an uptick in attacks on synagogues and temples. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Marcy Jones is breaking down where the money will go. Marcy? Good morning, Nicole and Roger. That's right. Synagogues, temples, mosques, church, all of these places are ones that could benefit from this as well as nonprofits. But it's not an automatic handout. Each of them will have to apply individually. So this will go toward things like fencing, gates, extra security, locks, anything that provides more protection. Congregations like Enfield United Church of Christ, a place of worship that openly supports the LGBTQ plus community, says they're encouraged that lawmakers are recognizing the need for more security. Back in June, two men interrupted a sermon with hate speech while the church recognized Pride Month. The church was also targeted again last month when their bench was vandalized with hateful phrases. Many are hopeful these funds will discourage future attacks on religious entities. This money will be especially helpful to, to those churches that might be targets in their areas and don't have cameras and security systems and, and all of that in place. Governor Lamont is going to sign this today, making it official. Those funds will be available today. However, again, all of those places of worship and nonprofits will have to apply through the state and get funds up to $50,000 each. Reporting live in Hartford, Marcy Jones, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.